In this video, I am going to explain E1 CB mechanism. E means elimination, one unimolecular CB conjugate base. In E1 CB mechanism, we have to take a substrate which contain a electron withdrawing group and hydrogen and next carbon contains leaving group. Now electron withdrawing group withdraws the electron density make the hydrogen acidic in nature. When you add base into the reaction mixture, deprotonation takes place and we get carbonyl which is known as conjugate base. We know that when a dissociation takes place for an acid, we get H plus and A minus. A minus is the conjugate base of the acid. Next step is the rate determining step or the slowest step. Here leaving group leaves and negative charge over the carbon moves to the next carbon and forms alkene. This reaction is unimolecular reaction that means rate of the reaction depends on the concentration of the substrate not on the concentration of base. Here I am going to explain the energy diagram of E1CB mechanism. In E1CB mechanism the last step is the rate determining step or slowest step. In the energy diagram, y axis correspond to energy and x axis correspond to reaction coordinate. This is the energy of substrate and base. It reaches to transition state 1 and gives the intermediate carbon ion which is known as conjugate base. Next step is the slowest step. So that means energy requirement will be highest. So reach to transition state 2 and then it gives the product. So E2 is the activation energy of E1CB mechanism.